Hey family, what's good? This is your girl on the Bronze Goddess, and I'm actually here today to shoot a mommy-daughter spa night. My oldest daughter has been asking for one-on-one -on -one mommy daughter time. I thought what better way to do that than a nice pampering night in. So I'm gonna be showing you guys all of that in just a minute. This video is also in collaboration with a company called Soapbox Soaps. I started researching the company and I just fell in love with the ingredients in their products. Y'all know how I feel about serums and vitamins and oils and stuff like that in different ingredients. That just really makes me feel good whenever. I see natural and organic products ingredients in a product so they sent me over quite a few of their goodies and I'm gonna be showing you a few of them in this video but they sent me over their coconut shampoo and conditioner these are both color safe sulfate free and also paraben free they have vitamins E and K in them they also have coconut oil y'all already know coconut oil does wonders on just about everything I actually saw a meme the other day that said the person said they wanted to put coconut oil on all of 2016 that's how good coconut oil is so I can't wait to try these in my hair and I also got this right here, which is their pomegranate body wash. This has pomegranate oil in it, also aloe vera and shea butter. Gonna be using this. And then lastly for their hand soap, they sent me over this one, which is their Sea Minerals uh, liquid hand soap. So I absolutely love the ingredients in their products, but what I think I love even more is the cause behind the company itself. So for every single one of these products that they sell, they donate a bar of soap or a 30 day supply of clean water to someone in need, whether that's US or abroad. I think that is amazing. And there's a great way for you to actually track it. On the back of every one of their little products, they have what's called a hope code stamped on here. You can actually type this into your computer and find out exactly where they sent that bar of soap or exactly where they sent the 30 day supply of water that keeps everybody honest so anyway huge shout out to them because there's so many people that die unnecessarily every year from preventable diseases that could have been avoided by clean water or just a bar of soap things that we tend to take for granted here in America so I think it's a great thing for them to do to actually sell you an amazing product but stand behind an even better cause if you guys want to find out more about soapbox soaps I'll be sure to link them below without any further ado let's get started with today's video so we decided to kick off our mommy daughter spa night by doing a bit of a mocktail. So here we are, we have a little bit of a Sprite. I wanted cranberry juice, but I couldn't find it. So I added a splash of cherry juice and I added a maraschino cherry to mine. I love cherries, you're gonna tell by this video. This looked really, really cute and elegant. Uh, Yana really loved this. We actually named this little mocktail after her. So this is called the Yana. Then we decided to use our store-bought cupcakes and give them a bit of a makeover. So we're going to do milkshake cupcakes. So I have my little icing in uh, a little bit of a Ziploc bag and I treated it like soft serve. Drizzled it with a little bit of chocolate sauce. I'm going to hit it up with a little bit of the rainbow sprinkles. My girls love sprinkles. Of course we're going to garnish our little milkshake cupcake with a uh, little cherry. And then I'm also going to be using half of a paper straw. And this actually came out really, really cute. Yana had a milkshake cupcake like a year ago and she hasn't stopped talking about it. So I thought it would be fun for us to actually make one ourselves. So here she is trying to make one herself. The kid is a natural. Look at the flick of the wrist. <laughs> so she did really good. And then here's her little garnish on there. So now let's get on with the actual spa activities. So my daughter has a black mask. She wanted to do a black mask. She said it kind of reminded her of Venom from Spider-Man. The kid loves superheroes. So here she is putting it on, having a good time. She said then she put this on her um, lower half. She kind of looked like her dad because he has like a beard and a goatee. So here we are just clowning around, uh, taking selfies and just having a really good time. This is really fun to do with your kid. Anyway, she wanted to do her nails, so I have this bubblegum pink color that she picked and also a really pretty sparkly, um, glittery nail polish. So I'm doing that, and here's what she thought of it. My nails right now. Isn't that cool? So what you're seeing me do right here is actually a bit of dry brushing. I've been doing this a lot lately. It's supposed to be good for reducing the appearance of uh, cellulite, also for removing dead skin cells and help to improve your circulation. So I'm all about that dry brush life these days. And I'll typically take a shower and a bath in the same night, but I wanted to try out these products. I'm not a fan of just showing you products without me actually using them. I wanted to see how the shampoo and conditioner actually worked on my hair. So as you guys can see, here is me fresh out of the shower. 
and it did a really great job. I love the coconut scent. It smells very refreshing and kind of like you're on a tropical vacation, but it really left my hair feeling really, really super duper squeaky, squeaky clean. So I loved the way that it worked on my hair. Now, nothing says um, pampering and luxurious like a nice decadent bubble bath. So I'm using a little bit of their pomegranate body wash to add to my bathtub because I like lots and lots of bubbles. I'm adding my absolute favorite bath bomb. And I have candles lit and of course the water is nice and pink and it's super, super girly and very, very inviting. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to thumbs up if you did. And if you want to find out more about Soapbox Soaps, I'll be sure to leave the link below.